I'm not a flamboyant sort of person, so it's hard to get out of here and be in Hugh Jackman. It was all work and no play. Way too serious for me. Five. Six. Six. I tried to smile, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't think it was a five. Because this is your song this week, I really want the Cory to match your intensity. Somebody who told me by the Killers is important because when I'm racing, this song sort of becomes my companion and it fires my engine up and gives me the motivation and belief in myself. One, two, one, two. <laughs> Did anything you say correspond to what your feet just did? Tango is all about intensity, focus and drives. Not only does the dance suit Kane so well, his song is perfect. I really want him to listen to the music and to get the timing right. It's way out of time. Jess is always talking about the beat. She could play Michael Jackson, I wouldn't even know that she changed the tape. One, two, three. Well, the judges said that I was all work and no play, so hopefully with the tango, which I think is more suited to me, I can just get out there and give it my all. It's quite difficult. I always said it was easy. Dancing the tango, Kane Eckstein and his partner Jessica Prince. Dancing's Iron Man, Kane Eckstein and Jessica Prince. You just got a semi-standing ovation from half the crowd for dancing. That was pretty good. I don't, I'd rip something. <laughs> oh, I don't think... Did you, did you rip your shirt? I think. I don't think anyone's complaining. I didn't want to look down because I heard something just rip. <laughs> My stomach hanging out or what? Um, would anybody complain if your stomach was hanging out? No. no. Um, did you get him to loosen up a bit this week? I think we did. We tried really hard and... Yeah. It was alright, that put me off, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know what happened in that first lift. I actually thought it was my dress. It was, it was like... crazy, no. It was me. <laughs> did you find the intensity of that dance perhaps suited you? Yeah, I liked it more than last week. The job yeah, was did? out of my comfort zone, so... Oh. A year ago, I wouldn't have been able to do any of them, so I'm going alright. <laughs> He's doing good. He's doing good. Uh, one lady I'm sure was impressed this week, Helen Ritchie. Yeah, yeah, I was impressed. Look, the, the natural intensity of this dance obviously does suit you, but it doesn't mean in other dances that you're not going to have to come a bit more out of your shell. You were just lucky tonight, I think, having a yeah. dance like this. Well, no, not lucky, because I think it's been your personal best so far. Yeah! OK, but... OK, I, I was aware that there was something... You were, your attention was on something else in different places, as if you were concerned about something. Did something rip or tear yeah, a bit Yeah, in clothing? the first... I think that's oh, a part okay, of my okay. shirt or something. Oh, no, yeah, OK, really... well, but nothing... You didn't yeah. lose anything, so don't oh, worry about you know, it. I thought it was a whole vest. I didn't have a clue. OK, I think uh, when you... Tango is a dance of compression in the legs, OK, and it's consistent compression and it's a flat dance. But when you do that and you lower through the knees, try not to lower through your behind yep. because otherwise you look like you're sitting. So if you, yeah. you're pushing something down but you're also holding your hips up to the lady. But, yeah, as I said, it's your personal best. Thank you. Yeah.
Josh, um, you're handling the choreography very, very well. And again, with your lifts, they're very powerful and they're very strong, and I feel at ease. Um, I think you've got the ability to be the best male performer in this competition. <laughs> However... <laughs> gotta calm your mates down. However, <laughs> I have to tell you something. I don't even know who the real you is when you're dancing. When you're dancing, I feel nothing. I just don't feel anything at all. It, you're, it, you're dancing with your mouth closed and it looks like you're holding your breath, so when you look like that, I end up holding my breath the whole time while you dance. Please work more on the performance element so you can captivate us. Yep. All right? Thank you. Great job. I totally agree with the, the last part of that. Yeah, it's, it, you are doing tango, but just because you're doing tango, there's still um, a feeling and a character involved, which is more than just, well, almost looking down into the middle distance, which is kind of what you were doing. Um, we need to feel something when you dance. You're a great, actually, you're quite a good technician, and I'm very confident when you dance with the choreography, but as we keep saying, it's so much more than that. You've got to really just let loose. I think you're terrified that you're not going to look like a man, but you've got to take a leaf out of... Um, Fev's book and Brian's book, who are the men's men, you know, they're camping it up like Oxford Street. You've got to, <laughs> you've got to tap into a bit of that and no one's going to say that they're not men's men. You've really got to find that. I mean, from the way your mates are carrying on, maybe they should be out here. <laughs> <laughs> Awesome, thank you very much. Uh, you know who you remind me of? You remind me of Danny Green. Because remember the first couple of weeks yeah, Greeny was yeah, here? Very and he was, so. he was very athletic and, and quite uh, stiff and hard to move. And then one day it clicked. Yeah. Yes. And, and he went on to go to the grand final. So I reckon you guys have the potential. You're actually going to stick out if you don't do that in this yeah. competition. Particularly, yeah, with yeah. this competition this year. Guys, well done. Yeah. Go and relax with Mel backstage. And a support came in his charity at the John McLean Foundation. Call 1902 Her SMS came to 11777. Voting lines open at the end of tonight's show. Pain. Phil, you got some pretty interesting comments from the judges. It was your best dance, even though you had a little rippage there. Yeah. But you still need to work on you being you on the dance floor. How are you going to do that? I don't even know who I am on the dance floor. I'm not going to lie, I've never danced before. So I think it's just getting comfortable and showing the real me, which for me at the start is not very easy at all. So. Oh, stop laughing behind. It's not your turn. It's not been hanging out, something ripped. I'm no, it's, it's Brian being silly. Well, you know what? One thing I can say is, no matter what the judges say, you're still gorgeous. <laughs> Thank you. Judges scores. Ladies and gentlemen, the judges scores. Todd McKenney. Six. Helen Ritchie. Seven. Josh Horner. Seven. Twenty. We got a 21, so it wasn't my best one, but it was, it's good. I'm happy with it. I, I'd be happy with it. You look great.